remember these. It's probably one of Marianne's unfinished masterpieces. There's two of them. Maybe they were us. In some weird way that only made sense to Marianne. She took so many pictures. Yeah. Like she had to document every second of our lives. You can keep some of them. If you want. <laughs> no thanks. I mean, I like the photos of us, but I don't think I can forget that she was the one aiming the camera. Wow. I'm so embarrassed for us. Many Da Vinci's we were not. She saved every drawing we ever did. There's a couple of these I might keep. یاد آوری خب این از این خاطره مام about me joining the hockey team مام sorry what uh, not now maybe next year but you promised keep whining and my next year will become never can you cut my hair your hair is fine but I want to cut it short really short what look I'm tired and I'm busy Let's talk about this later. You always say that. Marianne said no to everything. It made me so pissed. She was always on edge those last few months. Yeah, and completely deaf to everything I was telling her I needed. She pretty much always said no to me too. True, but it felt personal with me. She was trying to save the planet way before Al Gore made it cool. Has Al Gore ever made anything cool? Nah. I guess she was right about one thing. But you can't really blame anyone for not listening to crazy Marianne Ronan. I just found out that Marianne, mother, was not very good. She was not very good. I didn't realize how much I missed the smell of firewood. I miss the cold winter nights curled up here with big mugs of hot cocoa. Yeah. Marianne was so tired she was usually asleep on the couch. We use our voice so we didn't wake her up. And then we'd be up all night telling stories and watching the fire die. And Marianne was none the wiser. She was trying to save the planet way before Al Gore made it cool. Has Al Gore ever made anything cool? Nah. I guess she was right about one thing. But you can't really blame anyone for not listening to crazy Marianne Ronan. خب هدف چی بوده صندوق گنج را در اتاق دو قلوها پیدا کنید خب اتاق بچه ها یا باید اینجا باشه بالا باشه نه اتاق مریان اتاق مادرشونه اینجا هم که همون بوده یا دیدیم اما تو همون اومدیم اینجا بری این درس در بکیارد اما مریان کاب می yeah, well, we both know pretty was never my thing. خب بریم بالا اتاق دو قلوه بعد این بالا باشه. اینجا که چیزی نداره. را این راه رو هم چک کنیم. Where do you come from? داستان دو شمشیر. اسم کتاب است. Yo, what are you doing down there? What do you think I'm doing? Trying to figure out if anything in Marianne's mess is worth keeping. Any progress? Not really. What about you? What are you doing up there? I'm tired of her mess. Let's dig into ours. Right. Guess it's time to mainline nostalgia. کردن خب بریم داخل اتاق رو چک کنیم بریم چه خبر از اتاق صندوق گنج رو گفت رو پیدا کنیم Now 
this, this feels like home. Hey you. I just found your twin under the house. We've seen better days. آها یه دو قلی بودن دو تایر داشتن عروسکا. یکیشون پایین بود. زیر زمین که داشت میمد بالا دیدیمش. Oh, this one wasn't mine. این مال آلیسون اون یکی مال خود پسره بود. مال تایلر. خب تگ کردن. So much for my dream of being a hockey star. Marianne thought sports were too aggressive, too competitive, and too group thinky. How did you convince me to let you put this up? It was my favorite movie. شهر اش. پسر فیلم بوده. You know, if there's one thing you gotta give Marianne, it's that she let us explore our artistic side. You should have seen Eddie's face when I tried to repaint his car. Yeah, I bet Uncle Eddie didn't appreciate your artistic touch. I'd rather you called him Chief Brown if you're going to be an ass about it. Look what I found. What? Only our greatest creation, the Book of Goblins. <laughs> Seriously? It was in that chest the whole time? All these stories. I had ideas for so many more. Marianne wrote a lot of them. اول واقع حق صحبت کردن رو پیدا میکنه. پرس شاه دوخت سگ آبی خان رو درست میکنند. او هفت و نه صفحه است. صفحه سه. اول واقع حق صحبت کردن رو پیدا میکنه. یک شو بخونیم. روزی روزگاری در جنگلی پنوبر و باستانی اول واقعی بزرگ در برکی کوچک زندگی میکرد. اول واقع موجودی آرام بود که بیشتر وقت خود را صرف خوردن، شنا و خواب میکرد. خب ما یه اول واقع کار دیگه هم میکنه غیر از اینا. از صبح تا عصر او تمام کارهایی که اول واقعی کوچک انجام میدادن را انجام میداد. تنها در مقیاس بزرگتر، بیشتر غذا میخورد، بلندتر میپرید، باهوشتر بود و سر و صدای بیشتری میکرد. همه موجودات صدای بلند او را میشنیدند و همه از این بابت خوشحال بودند گم شدن در جنگل آسان بود ولی با تشکر از صدای بلند قورباغه موجودات می توانستند به راحتی خود را به برکه قورباغه برسانند شاید اگر قورباغه بزرگ شب هنگام آواز می خواند موجودات نظر دیگری داشتند ولی قورباغه حیوانی تنبل بود و بعد از تاریخ شدن هوا کاری نمی کرد یک روز یک مهمان ناشناس برای اولین بار به جنگل آمد زنی زیبا بود که لباسی بلند و زیبا پوشیده بود به صورت از میان جنگل قورباغه از جنگل عبور می کرد گویی از چیزی فرار می کند هیچگاه هم به پشت سر نگاه نمی کرد چشمای زیادی شاهزاده را دنبال کرد اما کسی جرات جرات نداشت به او کمک کند چرا که شکارچی دیوانه به دنبال او بود می گفت می گفتند به ما ربطی نداره بهتر ندید بگیریم چرا که شکارچی دیوانه مردی بیرحم بود که هیچ چیز را بیشتر از شکار کردن چیزی برای پول و افتخار دوست نداشت هیچ چیز نمی توانست مدت زیادی از چشمان نافذ او مخفی بماند برای همین دنبال ردپایی در برف و صدایی در باد بیرون رفت ولی چیزی نشنید و چیزی پیدا نکرد شاهزاده گفت عجیب شاید دوز داخل خونه قایم دوز داخل خونه قایم شده روزها گشت و گشت پشت پرده و زیر تخت زیر شیروانی و دودکش پشت ستونها و زیر فرشها ولی چیزی پیدا نکرد و همانطور که میگشت غذاها هر روز و هر شب ناپدید میشدن شاهزاده با عصبانیت گفت کیک میپزم یک کیک بزرگ که به همه تخم مرغ ها و میوه و آجیل هایی که دارم با همه اونها دارم اینطوری فقط یه چیز دارم که حواسم بهش باشه تمام روز رو به کیک از هر چیزی که داشت سپری کرد کمتر از یک ساعت بعد قورباغه بزرگ به آن سوی جنگل کهن رسید و در کنار کناره ساحل دریاچه عمیق بی سر و صدا رو به روی کلبه چوب... کلبه ای چوبی و متروکه فرود آمد. شاهزاده همین طور که حیوان را میبوسید گفت ممنونم فقط ای کاش میتونستی حرف بزنی که بفهمم چی میخواستی. در همان حال که این حرف را به زبان آورد اتفاق خارق العاده ای افتاد. ناگهان قورباغه میتواند سخن بگوید. حرف های اول قورباغه شاهزاده را از جا پراند. شکارچی دیوانه دنبال چگارچی دیوانه همیشه دنبال من الان شما در ایمنی هستید و من هم انتقامم رو گرفتم فعلا می توانید توی این خونه بمونید خیلی وقتی که متروکه مونده ولی و کسی هم اینجا دنبالتون نمیگرده سپس بدون اینکه پشت سرش رو نگاه کند به داخل مرداب پرید و اینطور بود که قورباغه بزرگ شاهزاده را نجات داد و توانایی صحبت کردن یافت 
اوکی خب از این داستان جالبی داره ولی خب خیلی طولانیه بعد هم باید بخونیم With the way Marianne was, I tried extra hard to keep it a secret. Marianne. Yeah, that day she found out about it. Yo, the lady. Mom. Mom. Mom, where is it? What did you do with it? What now? I can't find my diary. I know you stole it. Give it back. Sweetie, whatever I do, it's just for your benefit. You read it, didn't you? You had no right to do that. I have the right to do whatever I need to protect my little girl. I'm not your girl. I hate you. You will always be my little girl. And no matter how hard you fight me, I'll fight twice as hard to keep you safe. saw it coming she told me right to my face she was willing to hurt me to keep me from transitioning Tyler there is no way you could have known she'd go that far diary back her room was the only place I didn't look okay but do you need to get it like now that diary was important to me Allison writing down my thoughts helped me realize who I am well then let's go find it You think her room is still locked? It always was. I'm not looking forward to going in there. I know, but we'll have to eventually, and I need it back. وارد اتاق خواب میریان شوید. دیگر نباید بریم وارد اتاق خواب شیم. این بود. اینجا دور خاطر است. Ice King finally caught the hag. His furious voice could be heard throughout the forest. For your wickedness, you will be eternally bound to the lake. What? No way. Quiet, let me finish. You will no longer be allowed to leave. Not even under a full moon. The moon hag was imprisoned in the lake, and she never again tried to escape. Hmm. Hmm. And then the title. What do you think? Not bad, right? Uh, I guess that's okay. But I would have changed the end. What? No way! Ice King. I totally forgot about him. That's because it was dangerous to mention his name. He was too powerful. Hold up. What? Remember this? Uh, unfortunately. You must solve my riddle to earn the right to enter the princess's sanctum. Nothing mm. a good hard shove won't take care of. I mean, yes, we could brute force it, but it might be kind of fun to finally solve it, right? We have different definitions of the word fun. Okay, well, if we break it, we're just gonna have to fix it for the sale. So let's at least try not to. You have the Book of Goblins? Yep. Hand it over. What are you looking for? The image on the door. It's making me think of a story from the book. One that Marianne wrote. You have a way better memory than me. Well, the Book of Goblins was my creation. And you'll never let anyone forget it. 
Here it is. The one about the princess's party. Give it a read. I think the symbols may represent something in the story. First ghost memories, now storybook puzzles. What a weird day. What a weird childhood. Touche. خب از روی کتاب بعد چیز کنی تمام بزنم بهتون چی داستان خرس و شاهدخت سگ آبی خانه رو درست میکند جن ها و غار یخی شاهدخت و دو دوست و الان اینجا رو باید چی کار کنیم خیلی واقعا باید سواله ایچ بیده خاصی هم نیست خب بچه ها من خود تحقیق کردم فهمیدم که این حل کردن این پازل جوابش توی یکی از داستان هست داستان خواندن صفحه 15 مهمانی شاه دخت اینه اولی دو داستان رو بخونیم مهمانی شاه دخت <تصفح> روزی روزگاری در جنگلی پهناور و باستانی شاه دخت ناراحت بود چون یک سال از فرار وی از خانه خود گذشته بود دوستان جنگلی شاه دخت که نراحتی وی را حس می کردند به خانه وی رفتند. پلیکان پارسا و, پلیکان پارسا و متین و گوزن شمالی دورندیش حیوانات را هدایت می کردند. خرس پیر با پنجای تیز خود و قورباغه بزرگ نیز آنجا بودند. حتی موش آبی مغرور که بیشتر, بیشتر شب هنگام از لانه خود, از لانه خود بیرون می آمد آنجا بود. خرس پیر از شاهدخت دعوت کرد تا بر پشت او بشیند و به او قول داد که هیچ گرگی سر رای آنها قرار نخواهد گرفت. سپس حیوانات شاهدخت را به دره پریان بردند. جایی که مهمانی شگفتانگیزی برای شاهدخت ترتیب داده بودند. در مهمانی بوفه ای از غذای دریایی وجود داشت که پلیکان با منقار همیشه پر خود آنها را تهیه کرده بود. اطراف پر بود از نورهای چشمک زن جادویی که گوزن شمالی بعد از ابرو شدن آسمان ترتیب آنها را داده بود و قورباغه خوش سوق در حال مخلوط کردن نوشیدنی های گازدار بود تنها موش و آبی بود که هیچ کاری نکرده بود و سخت کوشی بقیه حیوانات را مسخره می کرد شاهدخت در مهمانی خود گاهی در مهمانی خود اوقات خوبی را سپری کرد آنقدر خوب که فراموش کرد تا از دوستانش تشکر کند پریها که متوجه موضوع شده بودند تصمیم گرفتند تا کمی شیطنت کنند وقتی شاه دخت رفت و هدایای خود را باز کند سه جعبه یکسان پیدا کرد شاه دخت با تعجب در حالی که نفس نفس میزد برگشت و متوجه شد که تمام مهمانی ناپدید شده است پری های بدجنس گفتند این به خاطر نادیده گرفتن دوستانته ما دوستان تو ازت قایم کردیم ولی بازی کردن رو دوست داریم حس بزن که هر کدوم از هدایای طرف کیه تا دوستان تو بهت برگردونیم شاه دخت جعبه اول را باز کرد داخل جعبه مشعلی بود که وقتی روشن می شد حقیقت را آشکار می کرد. شاه دخت گفت آها یه نفر می خواد مطمئن بشه که وقتی هوا تاریک شد توی جنگل گم نشن و همیشه درست از درست را از غلط تشخیص بدم. کدومی که از دوستام چه این هدیه ای بهم میده؟ خب این گوزنه. دومی تا غروب آفتاب خیلی گریه کرد و بعد از آن هم بیشتر گریه کرد. ناگهان صدای از زیر خانه پرسید این چه صدای در میاری ما اصلا دوستش نداریم اصلا شاهزاده گفت داریم گریه میکنم چون شما دوتا هر کسی هستین خیلی با من بد رفتاری میکنید همه غذای من رو دوزیدین و تا و من تا و من تا قبل از پایان این زمسون زمسون سرد از گرسنگی میمیرم دریچه کمی باز شد و دو صورت دو صورت اخم از آن ظاهر شدند که از میان تاریکی خیره شده بود مجد دیگر گفت ما هم گرسنه ایم ما خیلی وقت توی این غار پنهان شدیم و حالا که زمستون اومده قضا نیاز داریم شاهدخ به دوستانش فکر کرد لبخندی زد و سپس گفت پری ها شاید اشتباه کرده باشم ولی قدردان تمام چیزهایی که دوستانم بهم دادن و تمام کارهایی که برام کردن هستم شاهدخ پاسخهایش را داد و پری ها مجبور شدن که در 
به یک چشم هم زن مهمانی را بازگردانند شاهدوخ یک به یک حیوانات را بغل کرد و برای کادوها مهمانی ها تمام به کمک هایی که از زمان آمدن به جنگل بو کرده بودند تشکر کرد و اینچنین شاهدوخ اولین سالگرد خود را در جنگل جشن گرفت خب صفحه اولش ببین اولیش که چیز بود دیگه گوزن شمالی خرس آخری هم کجا رفتش پلیکان بود پلیکان با منقاره همیشه بر خود خب بزا طبق این چیزی که میگن اولی گوز خرس پلیکان خودش بود Boom. We're in. RGB و زده به برق روشن مونده همینطوری. چراغ باحالی داره تو خونش. تو اتاقش البته. دفترچه خاطرات قدیمی تایلر را پیدا کنید خب یکی اول تو اتاق چرخ بزنیم خب دوباره چیز اومده خاطرات هست اینجا کجاست اینجاست یاداوری
Tyler. What? Look. چگونه فرزند در جنسیتی خود را بزرگ کنی؟ What? Where did you find that? It was on her desk with her papers. Seriously? Are you fucking kidding me? Look, we gotta be really careful not to overthink this. But it doesn't make any sense. She, she was mad, right? She was mad at I, I cut my hair. She attacked me because I cut my hair. She was mad and she attacked you. We both saw it. Then what is this shit? I don't know. I don't know. Tyler, come here. She can't do this to me. Not now. When I finally made sense of a few things. Well, that was your first mistake. Thinking the world made any kind of sense. Ten years in the grave, and she's still finding new ways to piss us off. Yeah. I think I need some air. Are you really, really sure? I finished back you. I am. Do it. Okay. Uh, here we go. <laughs> Whoa. Is it all gone? Yeah. It, it looks amazing. <laughs> really? Yeah. <laughs> I can't wait to show mom. She's been so sad lately. More than sad. She's been scary. Yeah, but not tonight though. It was almost like a party. <gasps> Thank you, Allison. You don't have to thank me. You're my sister. I feel more like, like your brother. Brother, sister, we look out for each other. But I'm pretty sure I just gave you a really bad haircut. <laughs> <laughs> الان تقریبا فهمیدیم قضیه از چه قراره مشکل جنسیتی چی بوده
ای این فرار کرد اصلا نکشتتش این گفت با چاقو زدم خودش هم درست بکنم یادش نیمید چه اتفاقی افتاده بوده مثل این که We found your diary. Me too. I guess she was trying to figure out where you were at. Yeah, well, she should have asked. I wasn't some goddamn research project. I was her child. About the book. Raising your transgender child? Do you even know how rare these books were in 2005? Was she trying to figure out how to support me? Maybe. Which she wasn't trying. She never... <sighs> it doesn't make sense. I know. You cutting your hair was what set her off, right? Allison, she read my diary. She already knew. It wasn't my hair. And if we were wrong about that, fuck. You think she read it. It's possible she never even opened the diary, and that things are exactly like we always thought they were. But if she did, and they aren't... God, Tyler. Sure. I mean, we could have been wrong. But what good does it do to ask the question now? You mean other than not having to live with the thought that my mom tried to kill me for being me? Tyler, I know you want there to be something to find. Something that'll make it all make sense. But she was unhinged. So that's it then. She was crazy. Nothing else to say. I think we'd be better off if we tried to move on. Why don't we talk to a few people who knew her? See if that book makes any sense to them. People don't want to talk about Marianne. They pretend like that night never happened. باید تسا جوابی داشته باشه دوست مادرشون What about Tessa? She was Marianne's closest friend Let's ask her about it Sure But I'll warn you she's particularly touchy about this subject Well, maybe she'll talk to me I was always her favorite Operative word was But we need to go by the store anyway To get a few things for the repairs Great Two seagulls, one stale hunk of bread I'm not sure I like that analogy Listen I know you don't want to keep talking about this, but you're obviously not going to be satisfied until we do. So let's talk. چرا برای فروش خونه عجله داری؟ So I was thinking, hmm? do we need to be in such a rush to sell this place? We've been over this, and we both agreed it's time for a clean break. I know. Trust me. I'm not talking about staying for long. Just long enough to get some answers. And you think this house has those answers? Maybe not, but it's a place to start. Well, it would be a shame if there was something to find and we tossed it out. How about we start digging without putting off the sale? And if it seems like we need more time, we'll talk about it then. Okay. Okay. <laughs> You've been on edge all day. Is there something more going on with you? It's nothing. Pretty sure it's not nothing. And I'd like us to be on the same page. I thought we were on the same page. Sell this place as quick as possible and move on. And then we found the book and things changed. You really don't get that? It's just with the way you avoided this place for the last three years, I thought you wouldn't want to spend any extra time here. Oh. So that's what this is about. Maybe a little. Yeah. It's just... You graduated three years ago. And this is the first time we've seen each other in person. It's not that I didn't want to see you. I just... wasn't ready to be Tyler in Delos Crossing. I tried to visit you. I tried to go to your fireweed graduation. 
I wanted to bake you a crappy boxed cake and take awkwardly posed photos. I know. But you shut me out. All I got was non-responses and half-assed evasions. همه چی درباره تو نیست از دست همه قایم شده بودم اولی بهتر همه چی درباره تو نیست It was about me not you and making it about you is really not cool Seriously that's it Seriously Okay then نقشه ای داریم دو یه پلان So we have a plan Yep We ask around about Marianne but we also stick to our repair schedule if that's really what you need. All right. Deal. Ollie's diary. It's been a long time since I heard that name. Was I the oh. only one who ever called you that? Actually, no. I used it at Fireweed for a while until I settled on Tyler. Most people were pretty chill about the switch. Not everyone, though. What do you mean? I had a mentee who refused to call me Tyler. He didn't want my help. He didn't want anyone's help. I'm sorry. I like the name Tyler, by the way. Thanks. Boss <laughs> Gardan. Uh, Alison da Maman do bare baham bahsashun shode. Had dagan Maman dige faqat sar man dad nemizane. Be nazar mirasid ke Maman babat e inke behesh nagoftum qarar tu tu jangal chekar konim hasudish shode. نظر عالی اینه که بهش درباره آواز خوندنمون بگیم فکر کنم همین الانش هم میدونه وقتی که مامانم گفتم میخوام عضو تیم هاکی بشم خیلی ناراحت شد انگار انجام یه ورزش پسرانه کار اشتباهیه مدام ازش میپرسم هفته بعد دوباره میپرسم دوباره گفت نه خیلی ازش عصبانی هم چرا همیشه میگه نه چرا نمیذاره کاری که دوست دارم رو انجام بدم من و آلیسون شروع به داستان نوشتن کردیم خب آلیسون شروع کرده هر موقع میخواستم یه چیزی رو تغییر بدم خیلی خوشش نیومد چرا یکی از گاب... چرا یکی از گابلین ها نمیتونه پسر باشه صفحه بعدی دیروز خونه بابی جنگ بابی... دیروز خونه بابی جنگ ستارگان نگاه کردیم لوک عالیه اما مامان فهمید که این فیلم این فیلمو نگاه کردیم و عصبانی شد گفت این فیلم داره جنگ کردن رو تبلیغ میکنه رفیق شنبه پنجم فوریه 2005 اگه کارهایی که مامان میخواد انجام بدم آیا وقتی به هم نگاه میکنه خوشحال تر میشه خودم رو نمیبینه کاش که میتونستم بهشون نشون بدم کاش که میتونستم کاری بکنم که بفهمه فکر کنم خودش نمیخواد آلیسون دوباره بهم گفت که تغییر من بوده تقصیر من بوده که مامان از دست مون عصبانی شده پایمال <تصفيق> مامان اصلا این چند روز خیلی حرفی با همون نزده حالی گفت دیده که مامان داشته برگایی کتاب گابلین ها رو دور میریخته بعدی اون کارو بکن دیگه تعمال صداش رو ندارم دیگه حالم داره از اون اسم مسخره به هم میخوره آلی گابلین هم اوکی صفحه بعدی دیگه نداره نوب <تصفيق> I think I'd like to end up somewhere like this, just not here. Somewhere with more trees than people? Exactly. Just go into it with a little more of a plan than Marianne did. I think Marianne had a plan at some point. She had all that survivalist gear, a uh, mostly working generator. I think she was making it up as she went along. Maybe, but maybe that's just how she was at the end. After she lost it. Not a bad view, right? I forgot how beautiful it is. Remember that time we tried to cross the lake after it froze over? Oh yeah, how can I forget? Marianne lectured us for an hour. Well, she wasn't wrong at least. It was really dangerous. If we'd fallen in, no more goblins. We grew up on this lake. We know how to spot thin ice. I think that's enough time enjoying the view. I wasn't gonna say anything, but... Yeah, yeah, I know. I was the one all eager to go, and then I started waxing poetic about the landscape. Go ahead. I'll catch up. 
Need to respond to a message. Ah, my sister, the social butterfly. Seems we got a trespasser. Huh? What the fuck? You got five seconds to talk me into defending my property. Your property? Five. Four. I'm Tyler. No known in Tyler's. Three. Two. Sam! Ellie? What are you doing out here, girl? This is our house. Was I talking to you? Sam, put the gun down. This is Tyler, my brother. Well, your brother? Oh, shit. Huh. I guess I heard about all that, but I never. Damn, you look like a real man. So do you, Sam. You know <laughs> what I mean. She go. Didn't know they could make a woman look so much like a man. بریم بهش. من یه مردم. Not a woman who looks like a man, Sam. A man. A real man, just like you. Oh shit. Yes, I'm the asshole again. You got to excuse us old guys. I really don't. Come on. You kids keep changing the rules. Can't expect us to keep up. Just respect the people are who they say they are. It's not hard. No, it ain't hard, but it just takes some getting used to. We'll get used to it, cause we aren't going anywhere. So, what are you doing here exactly? Oh well, I, uh, I've been kind of keeping an eye on this place for you, you know, like patching the roof. Checking the pipes and all that stuff. Thank you, Sam. Oh yeah, yeah it's uh, that's no big deal. I just, you know, so your mom was like, uh, the special lady. She deserved much better. Than, you know, uh, what you got? Didn't you used to help Marianne with repairs and building projects? Oh yeah. Yeah, seeing as your mom had never had a man around. It's, I took it on myself to help her keep this place standing. How antiquated of you. Thanks. I uh, guess you two are still aiming to sell the place? That's the plan. Which, by the way, we need your keys. Since apparently you went and changed the locks? Oh yeah, absolutely. But, uh, selling your mother's house? Are you sure? Bad or good? That's all you've got left of her. هیچکس از تو نپرسید خاطرات بعدی هم داریم. بیا اینقدر دیگه بیشتر از این نرینیم بهش. خاطرات بعدی هم داریم. پشیموش دست حرفی که اول زد. Tyler. What? What Tyler means is a fresh start is what we both need. Of course. Yeah. This place has got to be full of all kinds of bad memories. But maybe some good ones too. Are you talking about space on the ground? Sagmaste, Boyat Berim. معمای روی درش شما دو تا دو سمیمی بودش سوال کنیم How well did you know her? Not as well as I thought When I heard what happened that night well, I figured people were bullshitting me It really surprised you, didn't it? Much as anything ever has Other folks say they saw it coming معمای روی درش Did you help with her door? Her door? The puzzle on her bedroom door. Oh. Oh yeah. 
Yeah, you two kept sneaking in, giving her no privacy, huh? You ever solve it? Yep. Better late than never, I guess. Uh, never solved it myself. Uh, I mean, not that I wanted to. I, I, uh, uh, so, uh, guess you know all your mama's secrets now, huh? Well, she may have one or two left. Psychmaster, boy, I'd better, boy, I'd better. We should get going. That's all you think we'll get out of him? اینقدر مسته که نمیتونه کمک کمون کنه. He's too wasted to be of any more help. I'll tell him to get a move on then. Well, we've got a supply run to make and Uncle Eddie's expecting a visit. So. Oh, right. Yeah, of course. Uh, get going, you two. Um, Sam, we all got to get going. Oh. Yeah, of course. Course, yeah, I got lots to do myself. I, hmm. Lots of to do is on Sam's either. list. And you don't want to keep Brown waiting, you know? <laughs> Thanks for looking out for this place. I see what's in Kimmy Zany with Chuck. I uh, don't hesitate to reach out if you need anything. Anything at all. You hear? Sam? Huh? Uh, Sam? Huh? The keys? Oh, yeah, of course. Of course, yeah, they're, they're yours. I, uh, uh, this place, it meant a lot to your mother. It almost felt like you know, it was a part of her, and it's like some part of her is alive here still. Khairi Siri Shayaru. Hopefully the house doesn't turn out to be a murderous psycho that tries to kill us in our sleep, huh? Uh, yeah. Well, uh, take care of yourself, uh, both of you. Hey, we really do have a lot to do. Okay, go on. I'll be right behind you. Ready to Veni Vidi Vecchi? I'm ready to talk to Tessa. Just try to keep in mind that your memory of her is ten years out of date. Yeah, well, it wouldn't be if she reached out to me while I was in Fireweed, which she didn't. So I'm guessing this is Michael? خب الان قراره با آلیسون پلی بدیم خوبه کارکتر رو سویچ میکنه hey اینجوری هی ازنه یور دی آف یپ ویر هیر از پیترنز تایلر میت مایکل این از دی انوین کوورکر ای وز تلنگ یو بود 
I was there for your introduction to marshmallow vodka and wine coolers, and I've only worked my way up to annoying co-worker. Rude. <laughs> Don't worry. She told me exactly how miserable she'd be in this town without you. It's so good to finally meet you. The Tyler talk goes on 24-7, so I feel like I already know you. So, uh, you here to grab some stuff for the homestead, or...? Yeah, we decided it'd be easiest if we just stayed out there. We'll get it cleaned up faster if we literally cannot escape it. Hey, I'm all for efficiency. Cannot wait for us to get out of here. <sighs> What's that? Oh, uh, Michael is moving to Juno too. Oh, and did you guys plan on moving together, or...? Well, I mean, yeah. It'll be cheaper to share a place. But nothing set in stone. Makes sense. There could be room for you too. <laughs> for sure. The more Ronins, the merrier. I'm studying to be a chef, so uh, you know it'll be good eating. And hey, I only snore during allergy season and baseball. <laughs> How can I say no to that? <laughs> <sighs> you okay? Dead on my feet, girl. Got up at four to fish before work. It's been a day. Oh, you like to fish? Yeah. There's this spot called Buzzard Hole I go to at least twice a week. It's like an hour drive, but it's so chill, especially first thing in the morning. Shut up. I used to go there all the time. For real? Yeah. Hey, well, if you want to go sometime, holler at me. I don't mind sharing. Cool. Most guys I know get all Smeagol about their fishing spots. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at you two. Bonding over the most slow and boring way to kill an animal. She's just jealous because she couldn't catch a fish. Even if she filled the lake with cyanide I'm first. Not... Oh, never mind. Tyler, we better get started with our shopping. Yeah, I'll be around if you need anything. Mohi giri mudam jurshu. Davale pazi qollab mohi gardid gof kash mitunasam mohi giri beram. Oyler mi gof. Baresi kardan. Test is still doing that Bible study here every Wednesday. Mhm. مطالعه انجیل با پدر باتیستا بیش تا بید و دنیای واقعی رو تجربه کنید شبهای چهارشنبه ساعت هفت شب آفتیسا درخواست رو امضا کنید از مهاجرت سالمون ها جره گیری کنید دست از ساخت کلبه شکاری در نهر فانلند بردارید خیلی که ها نمیدن که ها نمیدن اداره پلیس دلوس کراسینگ اخیرا چند مورد نامه دوزی در داخل اطراف دلوس کراسینگ رخ داده ساکنین گزارش دادند که نامه ها و مرسولات از صندوق پستی آنها دزدیده شده به خصوص در بخش شرقی و مناطق آلمرا اداره پلیس دلوس کراسینگ از تمامی شهروندان خواهش می کند که بیشتر هوشیار باشند و خرید صندوق های پستی و قفدار را در نظر بگیرند لطفا هر مورد مشکوکی که مشاهده کردید سریعا گزارش دهید اگر هر اطلاعاتی با در رابطه با مزونین احتمالی داشتید با رئیس پلیس رئیس پلیس براون تماس بگیرید همون که بهش میگن امو خب بریم داخل Well hello Miss Ronan Did you forget something in the office? No, just doing some shopping. You remember my brother? Tyler? Your brother? Oh, right, Tyler. What a pleasant surprise. Didn't Allison tell you I'd be by today? Yes, I think she did. I just didn't expect to see such a dapper young man. <laughs> well, I did shower this morning. <laughs> did you just get back into town, or...? More or less. We've been working out at the old house. But surprise, surprise, after 10 years of sitting empty, It was missing a few things, hence the supply run. Ah, right. Well, we'll get you set right up. It must be nice to be home. Uh, I'm not sure nice is the word for it. Oh, of course. I assume being there feels complicated. That's one way to describe it. Well, don't let me keep you any longer. I'll be here if you need anything. Oh, hey, is Tessa around today? Um, the wife's not in at the moment. I'm sure she'll be around later, though. Okay, so we need candles and an all-purpose cleaner. Sham, what time is going on? Hey, how many people? Can you take a picture of this? All the good 
fishing spots are marked. گوشی مجا گذاشتم. I don't have my phone on me. And you know you could just Google all this later, right? Are you kidding, Allison? Old fishermen aren't going to share this kind of juicy intel on the internet. جالبه. سخت هم زده. No way. The trout king is still here. Hey Tyler, remember the trout king? Yeah, I saw it. I thought Tom might have retired him by now. Are you kidding? He never misses a chance to tell customers he won a trout derby. It was a 12-pounder. That was that pound. Hey Tom, when did you get that new California plate? They sent you their license plate? The band got it, Allison. But I pulled some strings to get that. So by pulled strings, you mean you gave Eddie a discount on those new waiters? I've got friends in high places. Hey, Tyler, candy or chips? You know I got a sweet tooth, sis. Oh, now what? Chips. Chips, but then you know what? I'll take the chips. شیپس و ماس موسیر خب بررسی کردن Let's see fresh cut peonies triple layer chocolate chip cake toasted marshmallow are you doing a dramatic reading of the fancy شام مقدس nope just browsing these fancy ass candles شام کوچک معمولی بسته شش تایی بیبو شام مقدس یخچال شام های کمبو مقدس بگیریم گنگش رو ببریم بالا دیگه کجا میذاری این کارتونا رو لند کجا جا میکنیش خب دیدن مایکل یو وانت می تو پیک اپ سم برد سیرپ فور یو ایت هاز سم راوند اباوت وای اف اسکینگ می تو میک یو تو مای ورلد فیمس پنکیک او باستد تمیز کننده میخواست استرابریز این نوامبر What do we still need to get? I haven't found the cleaning stuff yet, and I'm still debating whether to get the off-brand cola or something fancy, like orange soda. Man, I haven't shopped like this in ages. Take your time and enjoy it. Oh, Shuyando, Inja. Any opinion on cleaning products? Pakonande tabiye tamam sutu. بوم رنگ تمام سطوح تمیز کننده همه چیز ارگانیک بزنیم ارگانیک از بیتر خب صحبت کردن انفنتوری ها؟ اه یا مای مایند از سو نم رایت نو اینوی هاوز دی شاپنگ سپری گوین فایندنگ ایفرینگ یو نید اینجا خیلی به امریخت است I don't know who arranged all the shelves today, but they're a total mess. Are you coming for me, Ronan? Do I have to remind you of the great spreadsheet disaster of 2014, huh? We don't talk about that. I just made one tiny function mistake. Which wound up in the store almost ordering $10,000 worth of tampons. <laughs> <laughs> you really saved my ass when you caught that. Yep, and you still owe me for it. Anyway, how's your day going? خب به هر حال چه خبره یه چیزی پیدا کردیم دلم نمیخواد برگردم اونجا خب واقعا دلم نمیخواد برگردم اونجا چون این کاراکترش زیاد دوست نه اونجا باشه How are you feeling? Still unsettled but it'll pass. All right. Well, I'll be here if you need me. 